She was a, a cost and management accountant, mm. but my elder sister is a teacher, and the second one is a teacher. We Where is the first sister. one? The eldest one? She's she's at home. Well, she's in her house. So now you people, you need prayers. Are you hearing me? Because yes, I'm sir. saying to you, because I'm seeing someone who was a teacher on him, even on your side, also. but on his side, the person passed away. Yes, it was his brother. His older brother. Yes. So now they want to kill this one. Now. It's true. We've been seeing dreams about death. Can, can you hear that? Can you hear how God works? Yeah. Now meeting these people for the first time, the, the mama say we have been dreaming about death. Even the children. Even my daughter. My daughter. My daughter. My daughter. Uh, let them come here. Come here. Come. Daughter's got come. Oh God. Where's the where's Osam? Awesome. Osam. Awesome. 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 And I'm sure I'm meeting this family for the first time. Yes, right? you do, man of God. Tomorrow I want to prophesy you. Ooh. So now let me tell you, this spirit is cancelled today. Amen. Amen. And no one will die. Amen. Amen. And, you know, out of you, you see now you've got one, two, three. This. Yeah, and this, one of our child is. Another one. Yes. Huh? Yes. Where is this one? We have to send him away because of our yes. That's another one. All of your children are attacked. It's true. You understand? It's, it's true. true. All of them. It's true. Even this one. This one, you know, I want to pray for you to be a prophet test this one. Amen. So you know, you know why? You know why I want to pray for you to be a prophet test? Yes. The people who killed their mom. Oh my God! They thought the seat is finished. Yes, yes, that's so true. And now that's a father. Remember, I don't, I don't know you. People. You don't know us. Uh, uh, she has been prophesying already. She yeah. saw you. If it's before you came, she had a vision about you coming. Can you hear that? <laughs> Yes. Okay. 
Yes, you don't know us now, of course. <laughs> Silly Nikani. I'm standing next to my wife and I'm standing there next to my daughter. Tonight we have been blessed by the presence of the man of God, Prophet Andres uh, Simono from uh, Tembisa. We want to be grateful and thankful to God to what has happened to us tonight. We have received a prophecy. The first prophecy was my brother has passed away. When I was located by the man of God, he said to me, my brother, who is a teacher, he saw a teacher, but I, I confirmed that it was my brother who was a teacher and he passed away. And now the prophecy was that we need to pray, myself and my wife and the family, so that the prophecy that says, the death is now hunting for me, I am next. And also the prophecy went to my wife that she, they, they've got also a, um, a teacher at their family. So um, then it was then confirmed that death is not far from us. We need to pray. And then the prophecy went further. The, the prophecy went further when he alluded that um, this child next to me he wants to pray for her, for her to become a prophet. We started confirming exactly his words, that he was telling the truth. He was prophesying the truth to us, that the lady next to me, who is our daughter, has been prophesying already, and we confirm that she, that she is prophesying already. I can give my wife to perhaps say more. Evening. Uh, my name is Mrs. Nozuko Nikani. Standing next to me is my daughter, my sister's child, who have passed away in 2018. And besides her, it's my husband, Mr. Kolisile Nikani. Uh, I just want to say, confirm that the prophecy is true. When the man of God uh, located us and started prophesying to my husband that he lost a brother who is a teacher, who was a teacher, and uh, that was true because the brother passed away. And then he continued and said, my husband now is the next. According to one to what he sees is my, that my husband must also die. And we confirmed that to be true because we've been having visions. And then I, I, I also said to the man of God, even the children at home, they also see, they saw the vision about their father dying. And then the man of God said, where are the daughters? He called them from the back. They were sitting at the back. They came. And when they came, the man of God said, all, my, all, all our children are under attack. And we confirmed that to be true. And then he said, one of our, of our children, which is our son, uh, where is he? And he is not with us. We had to send him away because of too much attacks. So we sent him away. So we confirmed that it is true when he said our children, all our children are under attack. That was true. And he continued and said he want to pray for this one to be a prophetess. Uh, he said he, she is also under attack uh, because the people who killed her mother, they also, they thought now it is finished. 
it is finished. We confirm that to be true because her mother, he was married to the father and we know that the father, the attacks were coming from the father and uh, my sister died. And when my sister died, she used to have a lot of attacks. We confirmed that to be true. And really, before my sister died, we never knew that the, her daughter is a prophetess. And we started seeing that she's prophesying. Even We confirmed with the man of God that even before the man of God came, she saw and then she shared the vision with us that without us knowing, we didn't know. We were not on social media. We are not on Facebook. And then, but then she saw a vision and say she saw Prophet Andres coming, praying for her. We didn't know we were not away. And then later on, I was sitting at home. Holy Spirit just said to me, go and Google. I just typed the name Charis Missionary Church Facebook. <laughs> then I went on Google only to find out the very same day. It was the day that it was posted on the Facebook that the man of God is coming to Cape Town. Then we started phoning to confirm if this is true. And then we find that that was true and we were shocked because she saw the vision and we never knew. Even the pastor that is here, we don't know each other. It's a, we don't know each other. We never knew about anything about him coming to Cape Town. So we were shocked when we went on Facebook. I just went on Google and I saw this because we were just following. We will just Google. Sometimes we watch on YouTube. So we were shocked and yet she saw that. So we confirmed even other things, even about him dying, she will see and come and tell us. And then the man of God said, uh, for now, we must hide her. And that is true. We are not using the child. We are hiding her at our utmost best. She will share what she saw sometimes. Then we will tell the people, but we don't allow her to, to prophesy to people because we are trying to hide her. So when the man of God said we must hide her, it is true. We are doing exactly that. And we thank God that we could receive that confirmation. We thank God that God has given us the direction because this is what we are looking for. We were actually looking for a direction about her since she is prophesying. And we thank God that God has answered our prayers, even about our children. If it's about my husband, we thank God because our family now, we believe that our family is free and there will be no attacks as the man of God has prayed and said there will be no attack. Even here now, she is protected. We thank God for our lives. Amen.